Sermon number 180. Condemning his disobedient men. In the name of Allah, the Beneficent, the Merciful. I praise Allah for whatever matter he ordained and whatever action he destines and for my trial with you, a group of people who do not obey when I order and do not respond when I call you. If you are at ease you engage in, conceited, conversation, but if you are faced with battle you show weakness. If people agree on one imam you taunt each other. If you are faced with an arduous matter you turn away from it. May others have no father, woe to your enemy, what are you waiting for in the matter of your assistance and for fighting for your rights? For you there is either death or disgrace. By Allah, if my day, of death, comes, and it is sure to come, it will cause separation between me and you. Although I am sick of your company and feel lonely with you. May Allah deal with you. Is there no religion which may unite you nor sense of shamefulness that may sharpen you? Is it not strange that Marvia calls out to some rude low people and they follow him without any support or grant? But when I call you, although you are the successors of Islam and their worthy survivors of the people, with support and distributed grants you scatter away from me and oppose me. Truly, there is nothing between me to you which I like and you also like it. On with which I am angry and you may also unite against it. What I love most is death. I have taught you the Quran, clarified to you arguments, apprised you of what you were ignorant and made you swallow what you were spitting out. Even a blind man would have been able to see, and he who was sleeping would have been awakened. How ignorant of Allah is their leader Mavia and their instructor Ibn Abigar.